It's Sway in the Morning. Only on Shea 45. John Forte is here. Sway in the Morning. 37 minutes into the hour. 888-SHAY-45. Really interesting conversation. Big Head in um, Houston. What do you want to say to John? What's up, John? Uh, Peace, fam. I remember Four East Houston back in 2000, 2001. Yep. I just wanted to see you came home and everything. want to say, you know what I'm saying? Glad you made it back home and everything safe. I did mine, came back, you know what I'm saying? I was gone by almost nine years. Welcome back, family. You know what I'm saying? Seeing you on TV and everything was like tripped out because, you know, me and you shared the same, we was in the same cell block and everything, hanging out. Yeah, damn man, you got a lot of friends. <laughs> well, <laughs> you know, when 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 you when when you go away, it becomes a small community. But but you mm-hmm. know, it's I I, I don't want to. I've done this, and I, ho- I hope my brother's still on the line. But you know, it's like people who serve in the military. You know, there's yeah. certain things that that we'll see or that we'll experience while we're away that we don't necessarily want to you know relate to friends and family because this is just this is our camaraderie you mm-hmm. know and and you meet some really great dudes while you're away who become family mm-hmm. you know and, and and extensions and uh the one thing that i try to do is never to forget them or take those experiences for granted because th- th- these were life lessons you know mm-hmm. and it's not something that we brag about it's not something that we ever felt cool about it's something that we endured and um, hopefully most brothers will, will, will get to the other side. And in the meantime, they can live vicariously through the brothers who, who, who do manage, and brothers and sisters, because uh-huh. there's a lot of sisters away too, um, who, who, who managed to make it home. John Forte started with the Fugees, went solo, went off into another business, got um, 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 charged with, um, with uh, your charges were possession? Possession. All possession right. with intent to distribute. All right, 14 kilograms of liquid cocaine, was sentenced to 14 years? 14 years. 168 wow. months. And then you ended up doing how many? I did more than seven uh-huh. because on a, November the 24th, 2008, prior to leaving office, former President Bush commuted my sentence. Did you know him? No. No, I, I, I did not know did him. Did somebody lobby for you? I, I had, uh, you know what, I kid you not, and, and people have asked, you know, well, John, why you, why you, why you? All I can say is there, but for the grace of God, go I. I had so many supporters on on, on the outside. Mm-hmm. I, had, you know, one supporter in particular who I always have to big up is my 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 friend, my mentor, and my spiritual godmother, Carly Simon. Mm-hmm. You know, every day she she made phone calls. Every day she wrote letters. You know, she'd be on Good Morning America promoting her album, mm-hmm. and then you know, talking about Free John Forte. Mm-hmm. You know, on 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 Good Morning America, like legendary and, Carly Simon. Yes, indeed, and wow. um and and she she went to war for me, but you know she wasn't the only one people put their people put their their, their, their their reputations and everything on the line just for me even when I felt that I didn't deserve it you know these were people who propped me up and said you know you will do better if you're home than you will while you're there being and, locked up yeah, yeah. it's sway in the morning only on Shea 45